Saan? Bang 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 pala. Gusto mo kung masailan? Hi Builders! Welcome back to our channel. So for today's episode, tuturuan namin kayo on how to properly install solid polycarbonate. Okay, so before we proceed with the actual installation, no? so bakit nga ba solid polycarbonate yung gagamitin nyo for your project? So if you're looking for a material that is high impact, polycarbonate is actually 250 times stronger than glass. And if you're also looking for something that is totally transparent, so polycarbonate, especially solid polycarbonate, is a good choice. If you're also looking for something that is flexible, and lightweight material, then polycarbonate is the perfect choice for you. For curved applications, there's a recommended bending radius for each polycarbonate type and thickness. Let us know in the comments if you want us to do a separate video about it, or you may simply send us your inquiries online. Now, moving on to the installation. So, ano ba yung mga kailangan natin ng materials? We need the actual panel, of course, the solid polycarbonate panel. And yung ginagamit namin to cut yung solid polycarbonate yung grinder. And then, a flat bar, rubber tape, tech screws, the drill, and sealant. For the framing, so pwede tayo gumamit ng mga tubular na gawa sa GI, aluminum, or stainless steel. And also, wood is an option depending on your budget, of course, on your design, and personal preference. So, una nyong gagawin, kailangan i-peel off nyo muna yung edges. So, first, hindi natin ipipil off totally yung polycarbonate habang hindi pa siya completed yung installation to avoid yung scratches. Ayan. So, pag napil off nyo na yung edges, itong um, dalawang panel, so, idudugtong natin siya, gagamitan natin siya ng rubber tape. So, make sure lang na yung rubber tape ay equally in between your panel para lang ma-secure yung polycarbonate. So, ginagamit natin yung rubber tape para makaiwas tayo sa leak. Make sure lang na nasa gitna ng panel yung rubber tape. Ayan. So, after nito, ikakat natin yung excess na rubber tape. Tapos, lalagyan na natin ng flat bar. After nung rubber tape, so ipapatong natin yung flat bar sa ibabaw ng rubber tape. And then, isi-secure natin siya ng tech screw. Make sure lang to not over-tighten yung screw kasi kapag uh, sobrang mahigpit yung screw, it might cause cracks doon sa polycarbonate. Ayan. So, ensure natin na hindi siya sobrang tight natin i-secure gamit ang screws. I-secure naman natin yung sides. Ayan. Gamit ang silan. So, magkisilan tayo ng sides. Ayan. Siguro duhin nyo lang na ma sisil nyo maigi yung side ng polycarbonate na may rubber tape. Ayan. So, do this on both sides. And make sure lang na enough yung sealant. And then, linisin na lang natin siya after. Thank you for watching, Builders. See you on our next video. Bye!